Good night, ladies and gentlemen. This is old Chef Brent Thomas. And you want to cool with friends? Tonight, we conclude our Cooler Brent Vegan Week. I'll be making ricotta spinach pizza. So tune in right here, right now. Let's go. You're unbelievable. <laughs> Alright ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the show and now the ingredients you need to make your ricotta spinach pizza. Here are my ricotta cheese mixed up with with Italian seasoning, basil, add onion, garlic powder, you and the spinach, which I already thawed. I'm using frozen spinach. You can use fresh, you can use canned. You can use any spinach that you want. It's up to you. You decide. I have my homemade pizza dough and my shredded, low fat mozzarella cheese right here. So that's what you need for this recipe, all right? We're right back with the first step. All right. Welcome back. Now take your pizza dough, form it into a nice disc. Punch it down so it shapes like a circle. Okay, dust off the excess. See? Then you start to roll. Okay? Roll the dough out. Just like that. And then you. Down some more and roll it out. Okay. See? Just like that. We'll be back. Okay. Welcome back to the show. And now I right, add it into my 12 inch pizza pan. It's shaped like a circle. And now, I should roll it up and shape it up in a perfect circle. Then you get to take a ricotta cheese. Spread it around. Spread it around. Just like that. And take your spinach. I mean, sorry, take your cheese, spread it all around. Just like that. You can make it cheesy if you want. Then you can add turn it into your spinach. Just like that. Just spread the spinach around. And also, I wish all of you a happy Memorial Day weekend to all of you. For those that's watching, and we thank our brave men and women who protected our freedom and serve our country. We'll be back. All right, everyone, welcome back to the show. And now, the spinach ricotta pizza is nicely done, prepped, and everything, all right? 
So what I'm going to do, I'm going to pop it in my 400 degree oven and let it bake for 12 to 15 minutes or until it's all done. Real talk, one, two, three, we'll be back. All right, we'll make the show everybody now. My pizza's done. And also, I took, I took two tablespoons of butter. I melted down. I had garlic powder as spread around the crust. I want that garlic butter taste. That is optional. If you don't want, you don't, if you don't like it, you could leave it out. But that's up to you. Anyway, I'm gonna cut this pizza. I'm gonna cut it like this. And everything, all right? We'll be back. All right, we'll make the show and I already cut out my pizza into slices. And now, we're gonna do the taste test right here, right now. Taste test time. Here we go. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Delicious. Tastes good to perfection, all right? This finish. Ricotta pizza is the bomb, my friends. That's right. It's as bad as it gets, and it's Chef Brent approved. Yeah, there you have it. That's how you make the best ever ricotta finish pizza. It's made by the one and only Chef Brent Thomas. If I could do it, then you could do it, my friends, okay? So thank you for coming around this Friday night. As always, like, comment, subscribe, and share. Give me a thumbs up. Comment down below. Hit the subscribe button next to it. So one of you to do it, Brent. Have a good night. You're too legit to quit. As always, enjoy your weekend. I'll see you on Memorial Day. Good night.